The bearings on the monolithic mixer are sealed bearings. This means that they are designed to keep out the water and contaminants that come with mixing concrete. The main cause of a bearing blowout is over greasing. A sealed bearing doesn't need to be greased very often. In fact, if you do the math, you don't have to grease it but once a month. A little shot of grease every couple of weeks is plenty. We start by cleaning the bearing. These bearings can be extremely difficult to remove if there is a lot of concrete on the shaft. Once we have cleaned the bearing and the shaft, we can proceed to remove the bolts. Once the bolts are removed, we can then loosen the two compression screws on the side of the bearing. Now that the bearing is loose, we can start the fun part. Using a sledgehammer and a pair of crowbars, we can slowly pry the bearing off. In extreme cases, if the cement has filled the inner part of the bearing, we sometimes have to use a grinder to cut the bearing off. Once we have removed the bearing, we can take off the plate that holds the inner seal. The inner seal is then pried out and replaced. Once the inner seal is replaced, we can start to put it back together. It's important to make sure that the seal, shaft, and bearings are centered. A good way to ensure that the bearing is centered is to look at the inner seal from the inside of the mixer. Once you have replaced the new bearing and the bolts are tight, you are finished.